Hi, this is Nick Jeffries of New Projects and I'm just outside one of our new developments. So this is in Regal Road in Fulham, end of terrace, and we have just got planning to build a basement, loft conversion and full refurb. So come on in. So we have already started to strip out a couple of weeks ago. So as you see when you come in, everything's gone. The flooring's gone, carpets, skirting, cornicing, doors, everything. So when we start the basement, the bay window's coming out. We have a hoarding at the front. The conveyor will be coming through here. This, let's have a look. So we've already made a meaningful start. So underneath here, we've already taken out a little bit of earth. We, we did a trial pit to see what kind of earth it is. And, um, that is where the conveyor is going to be coming in. Through there, so the basement is going to go under the whole footprint of the house. So what we try and do, this part of the uh, ground floor will be coming up completely. This wall is coming out. The, uh, there's going to be a step, there's going to be a step here, taking it uh, down here, all this slab's coming up. We're going to be taking this ceiling up, just because when you um, look up here, to get a little bit more height, that goes up about another 12 inches, so we're going to take that up to raise the ceiling. As you see, there's, an, there's been a trial hole out here, so we can found the main drains there. We are going to replace this uh, side return with uh, electric Velux windows. So. Here, this is where the stairs will be going down into the new basement. So the basement is going to be, the size is roughly 800 square feet. It is going to be a finished ceiling height of 2.8 meters. So it's going to be a nice height. And um, it's going to be a bedroom, utility, playroom for the kids. They're going to have a entrance from the basement going up into the garden with a glass banistrade because the guy, uh, he wants access into the garden, which is quite unusual because the garden's quite small. So it's going to take up a little bit of space into the garden. So come on up. This, this layout's going to remain the same. So this is going to be the family bathroom. This one will be the spare room for guests. All new sash windows throughout, so these are all going. Ceilings down, new spots, new electrics, new lighting, every single thing. So again, similar to the one which we spoke about uh, yesterday, the one in Dolby Road, this is going to be blocked up. This is, another, uh, this is another spare bedroom. This is going to be blocked up. We are going to move the door further back here because this, from here onwards, all this is going to be uh, the kids' room and this wall is going to be demoed and here, is going to be 
a little en suite. So if we come through here, so this is going to be the master, master bedroom. These chimney breasts are coming out. Open this up and it's going to go into the little en suite. So it's going to be a little tiny en suite. Again, underfloor heating. Now the lady who is uh, going to be living in this house with the husband, she wants this, this room insulated. So she's going to be very, very uh, fussy about what insulation. So loads of insulation in the flooring, triple glaze sash windows, insulation at the top, because she does not want to hear the planes flying over our head in Fulham, because we're right underneath the flight path, path here. So we don't want any plane noise. Again, new electrics, uh, down lighter spots. So the new loft conversion is going up the top. So the, the staircase will be going up here. So we're going to have, a, I think, two bedrooms at the top and also a pod room at the back. So I think currently the square footage of this property is 1,600 square feet. So after we finished everything, it's going to be going up from 800 square feet for the basement and maybe 400 square feet for the loft conversion. So it's gonna end up being a nice property. Um, so yeah, so if any of you guys out there are looking to get a basement done or a loft conversion or a pod room, don't forget to give us a call 020-773-16841 or pop in and say hello. So as you see, this property is going to be undergoing some serious construction work. So as you see on this board here, this is this just notifies everyone uh, who comes in about our, our insurance, about our safety, uh, our F10, our health and safety policy, our first aid policy our responsibilities, our general policy for health and safety. So health and safety within new projects is priority. You know, we follow the CDM 2015 uh, compliance very, very strictly. So um, yeah, well, I hope you enjoyed our tour. And um, let's keep, let's cut, maybe we'll come back in a, in a couple of months time when we started the basement and you can really have a good look what's going on. On the outside, as you see, this here, this area here, this will all be excavated and this will be a light well. So under this will be another uh, bay, bay window, maybe a Juliet balcony door into the bay, into the light well. And uh, you'll have a walk on grill here and there'll be a fire escape uh, with a, a ladder. So if any emergencies, the people down there can actually climb up and uh, escape into this area here. So light well at the front, um, light well at the back with walk on glass and a stairwell. So nice project. So thanks for walking around with me and let's catch up soon.